we are back with another video. <laughs> I will put the play on the back. Get it together. And roll it. Welcome back. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed it. I didn't even start. Happy Dudes and Curls. It's Melissa Q. Welcome back. Today's video is going to be back into the top five. Yes, oh, we are wrapping it up. I did not talk about moisturizers because I felt like I talked about it in the leave-in top five. I will put the playlist up above in the iCards and down below in the description bar just in case you have missed anything and we want to make sure you don't miss anything, right? As well, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's going to let you know whenever I'm uploading. And I am doing the hair videos every Tuesday. I just want you guys to know what the schedule is. I think that every Tuesday I'm going to come with something hair related. Let me know in the comments what you guys want to see in terms of hair. I think I'm going to come once this series is over, come with a series of Q&A, like a natural hair Q&A. And yeah, let me know what else you guys want to talk about. So let's get straight into this video with the top five. These are my creamy style. I love wash and goes. I do. I do. Wash and goes are kind of like my lazy style that I can slay, you know, a wash and go. Uh, but my favorite natural hairstyle to wear is a twist out or a braid out more so twist outs than braid outs because i feel like y'all the sh shrinkage struggle is real like if i showed y'all how long my hair was i mean this looks short but really the struggle is real i want to show off my length sometimes that's why sometimes i wear it straight i want to show that i can go curly i can go long i can put a sleigh i can slay a ponytail you know i love to switch the hairstyles up i feel like that you know i can easily get bored but doing something to your hair changing up your makeup you know you feel refreshed and new and you know alive so that's just me y'all that's just me. I love twist out. So I wanted to come with my favorite creamy stylers. And then in the next video, I'm going to show you guys my favorite gels and puddings. I put those together. So hop right in to the creamy stylers. I do have an honorable mention because some of these are old. Some of these are new. Let's start with the OGs. Okay. I don't, I've talked about this way back in the day, but one of my favorite like creamy stylers, this one I can moisturize with at night as well. And I just so much enjoy it, especially in the winter months. This is the Whipped Pudding Rich Dense Shea Based Moisture Cream by Onion Handmade. I love this because it's super duper thick and dense like it says. And... I love this in the winter to put on my ends because I can moisturize and seal and this just locks in everything. It's a heavy butter. So if you are, if you have fine thin hair, steer clear of putting this over your whole strand. I highly recommend using this on dry hair, by the way. I don't know, something about it putting it on wet hair, it just streaks and it doesn't like fully coat the strand but when I can rub it in between my fingers and um, while it's emulsified and put it on damp or either dry hair I just feel like I get the best out of this it doesn't really have a hold to me but this is like super duper moisturizing so this is also great for me to like restyle but when a lot of times when I do my twist outs, I do take a wash and go, which still has gel in my hair. So I really don't need the whole, I need more moisture, but this is amazing. So I really do enjoy that. So another OG, I have not talked about this in so long because I have, this one is like brand spanking new and that is the Camille Rose Almond Jai Twist Butter. Oh, this is like, a great multi-purpose product for me too because I can use this for my wash and goes but I can also use it for my twist outs I can use it now this one has a really good hold I really do like it it's hydrating it softens and it says it also strengthens oh my goodness this is so good when I open this I know it says best moisturizing twist butter ever they lie they not lie 
this is like one of my favorite like creams period like that's that multi-purpose i can go wash and go and it is glycerin free thank you jesus the um whipped the whip pudding is glycerin free as well i think all of these are good yeah all of these are glycerin free recently the moisture butter the curlate moisture butter now this one to me is a bit thicker this one is a more dense and thicker than the almond jai twist butter the twist butter is a little bit more creamy to me it is a creamy it reminds the consistency kind of reminds you of the curl and hansen smoothie um i actually like this a lot better this oh it smells so good uh, uh, her stuff smells like bakery cake stuff anyway that this one is thick too this one is great for me for moisture and for the winter months i absolutely love this i love to moisturize and seal with this using a little bit of it and even in my wash and goes just going in and scrunching in the moisturizer i really do like that but this is so this is a great moisture butter it's so good camille rose girl you doing your thing. I'm digging more into the brand. These all are from Smooth Naturals, y'all. I'm a smooth criminal. This is Perfect Strands. I do have a review on this. Now, let me know if you want to if you want me to come with my favorite hair growth products. And um, yeah, but this one is Perfect Strands. This one is specialized for hair hair growth because it has coffee extract in it and it's supposed to stimulate the hair growth. It has green tea extract and coffee seed oil. I'm sorry, that's what it has, not the coffee seed extract. It's the tea, green tea extract and the coffee seed oil. And this is supposed to help stimulate the growth and really um, help you with hair growth. So I really do like this. It does not, this one does not really have a hold. It is a stiff butter, but um, I feel like that this is still great for twist outs, especially if you have, have high porosity hair because it's not too thick. It's uh, thicker than the whip, but it's still not too much of weighing your hair down, especially you can kind of like skip, skip in between. You don't have to moisturize and silk every single night with these because they're kind of thick so yeah the whip i whip my hand back up i whip my hand back up. yeah that's old this is so good this is great for moisturizing and sealing it reminds me a lot of the almond jai twist but this ain't going nowhere if this was a fallout i would like pass out but it's super creamy. This reminds me of the Almond Jai. This one you can put on your body as well. It was actually designed at first for your body. And I was like, mm. Janine, I'm going to put this in my hair. I'm looking at these ingredients. And this is really good for my hair. This stuff. Oh my goodness. I got a 10 day twist out like a couple of years ago. And my hair was so, oh, it makes my hair smell so good. Oh my goodness, it smells so, so good and it softens my hair. So I really do enjoy the whip. I do have a review, but it's back in the day. <sighs> Makes me want to review it over because some of my stuff just looks so old. I need a good a new camera, so please excuse it. Okay. The final one I want to talk about is the Triple Treats Hair Styler. Now this one has hold. I feel like that this one, out of all of the creams that I just showed you in terms of twist out, um, my styler this has the best hold as you can tell oh that smells so good but it is a dense styler because it is it has co cocoon butter has mango butter and I want to say it also has kupuwasu my hair loves kupuwasu butter and um, I just really really love this if you are looking for a product that's really healthy and it's going to give your hair shine and ooh, it's just going to do the thing this is the one if any other product that i would tell you to get 
it would be the triple treat. Those are my top five and an honorable mention. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of my top five. Please subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification button. It's going to let you know that every Tuesday I am doing a hair video and I also post videos on Friday and on Sunday. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what you are loving as your favorite styler. And also let me know what you guys want to see on Tuesdays. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe on your way out. And I will see you in the next few days in another video. See you next Tuesday, guys. Bye.